What's up guys, I'm Brian Sakawa. You're watching He Spoke Style. And today I'm showing you eight ways to wear khaki pants. First up is a look that I showcased on the website six years ago. Uh, kind of hard to believe, and that I can still wear it today is a testament to the fact that great basics never go out of style. Have the khaki pants that I'll be featuring throughout this video, and they are from Bonobos. I would call this the Goldilocks fit. Not too slim, not too baggy, but just right. Up top, two more staple items, a heather gray athletic sweatshirt by Levi's, worn over a classic OCBD. Accessories, simple and elegant watch on the wrist. Sunglasses are by Oliver Peoples, these are the Banks. And then finished off with a pair of white Common Project sneakers. Next we have basically the same look, although I've upgraded it a little bit to give it more of a business casual feel as opposed to the more casual vibe of the previous outfit. So two changes here. First, swapping the athletic sweatshirt for a merino wool v-neck sweater. This is by J. Crew, and again worn over the same light blue OCBD. Other change is the shoes. I traded the white sneakers for these penny loafers by Allen Edmonds. With only two simple changes, I was able to transform a more sporty outfit into one that I would say fits pretty well into that kind of hard to define business or smart casual category. Here we have a look that if it was 2012 or 2013 would totally break the internet. This is, of course, a menswear uniform of sorts. It's so classic, it's so easy to put together, and it really has you covered in many, many different types of situations. Breaking it down, first, the navy jacket from Michael Andrews Bespoke. Hop sack fabric and patch pockets give it a more casual, laid back feel. Underneath, once again, is the light blue OCBD, and then anchored by a pair of Allen Edmonds lace-ups. I'll be honest and say that it's been a while since I've worn this particular look, but styling it for this video reminded me how powerful a simple and classic look like this can be. If you haven't noticed, we've sort of been ramping up the formality with just some minor changes to the basic look we started with. And here is the last in that series before we change things up a little bit. This is a really classic, conservative, and for lack of a better term, what I would call a very American kind of look. It's got this kind of college prep thing going on, and I really dressed it up, of course, with the tie, classic Brooks Brothers BB number no. four rep tie. And then instead of a button-down collar, we have a spread collar shirt. Now, because I was thinking along the more preppy lines here, I decided to finish the look off with a pair of tassel loafers. These are by Johnston and Murphy. Moving on now to a look that I would put in sort of the grown-up casual category, but really is a look that would look great on anyone pretty much any day of the week. Khaki pants, because they are such a classic and staple pair of pants, I love pairing them with other classic items in a very classic menswear color palette. Here, I'm doing that by keeping it a little sporty up top with this navy rugby shirt. It's from the Nordstrom 1901 line. And then the piece that I would say makes it a little more grown up, this brown suede jacket, which I picked up at Billy Reed a number of years ago at a very deep discount. And then keeping the sporty theme going by finishing off with a pair of white common projects. Here's a look that is both simple and casually cool. It's always good to remember, especially as you get deeper and deeper into menswear and developing your wardrobe, that, as I said before, there is power in simplicity. The more you learn, you know, it's kind of easy to get bored with that, but when you actually get back to basics, you really understand, frankly, why it works so well. Here, I'm just keeping it very simple with a white OCBD, and then for some contrast and a little bit of casual edge, I threw on this black Levi's denim trucker jacket. Shoes, or actually boots, I should say, are my leather Chelsea's by Jack Irwin. Super comfortable, which is why I like to call Chelsea boots the loafers of the boot world. Up next is a look that's all about playing around with different shades of brown. I would say this is monochromatic-ish, only because the lighter khaki color kind of makes the monochromatic thing a little less obvious. Dressing tonally like this, it's always great to add in some texture, which is what I did with this suede trucker jacket. Really killer piece from the HSS Michael Andrews collection. Link to sign up for the launch announcement is right up there. Underneath, keeping it casually elegant with the brown turtleneck, it's by Ted Baker. And then a great accessory that really makes the outfit, in my opinion, a pattern scarf by Drake's. And then once again, finished off with the leather Chelsea boots. Finally, an outfit that I'm calling the Urban Explorer. What I want you to think about here is to actually imagine what this outfit would look like without 
the waistcoat. I think it would still look fine, but the waistcoat definitely takes it up to a different level, which is always the case when you're adding a tailored element into an otherwise mostly casual outfit. Speaking of the casual side of this, let's talk about the shirt. This is a Western denim shirt. It's by Polo Ralph Lauren. Notice the snaps instead of buttons. Up top, an olive green felt hat. It's by Worth & Worth. And then anchored by this great chocolate wingtip leather dress boot. This, of course, the Dalton by Allen Edmonds. So there you have it, just eight of the many ways to style khaki pants. As always, complete outfit details are down below in the description. Leave a comment, let me know which look you like best. Thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe, and until next time, thanks for watching and stay tuned.